after a dominating victory against the Buccaneers, the Minnesota Vikings are now in the NFC Championship going up against the Cinderella Story Carolina Panthers who knocked off the top two seeds in the NFC. They knocked off the two-seeded Cowboys and the one-seeded Falcons, and now they're going to try and continue their rampage and take out the three-seeded Vikings. Can they do it? We will find out. I don't think they will. But if this seven seed goes on to beat the one, two, and three seed, and let's say the Bills make it and they take out another one seed, that this might be the greatest playoff run in NFL history at that point with rookie Bryce Young and this young Panthers team. That would be the greatest run in NFL history. I'm saying it right now. You took you took out the four best teams in the league, basically. But what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to this Madden 24 Superstar Mode. I'm going to record both these. Um, actually, it could be just one video if we lose to the Panthers. But uh, if we do make it to the Super Bowl, it will be two videos. We'll be uploaded back-to-back -back Saturday and Sunday just so we can get this series done with. And I, I can move on to not only um, Gerald Johnson and um, Cedric Lewis, but I can actually move on to making a quarterback now. And I will be doing the start today because I know they just fixed that. But, without further ado, let's head into the NFC Championship game. The first time since, I believe, 2017. The Minneapolis Miracle was the last time the Vikings were in the NFC Championship. But this time, let's make it to the Super Bowl in Las Vegas. Remember last year, C.J. Lewis did not make it to the Super Bowl his rookie year. We lost in the wild card. He made it in his second year where he had to switch teams. So, let's see if we can win with the Vikings because I don't want to end this series with no Super Bowl, all right? That just does not make for a great series if we don't end it on Super Bowl. So, without further ado, if you guys are new here, be sure to leave a like, subscribe. If you guys are new, I make 2K and Madden content every other day. Uh, maybe we'll go to daily soon, maybe. I don't know. It depends. My upload schedule is kind of inconsistent. But, anyways, enough talking. Let's get into it. The NFC now runs through none other than U.S. Bank Stadium with both the 2-1 and one seed being knocked out. We have home field advantage in this NFC Championship game against Bryce Young, Miles Sanders, Adam Thielen, the former Viking, the revenge game. Oh, this NFL script is going crazy. Adam Thielen facing his former team for a possibility to represent his team in the Super Bowl. What a story. Thielen versus the Vikings. You already know that would be all the headlines. Would be the, Even though Thielen's not a top player, that'd be kind of weird. Even though Thielen's been a great wide receiver his career, and he's been doing fantastic with the Panthers this season, even though they're like 1-8. and eight. All right, we are going to start off with the ball, and obviously they're going to sack the box as we have best player in the league, C.J. Lewis. But we're going to go with a J. Jettas, but he does not get open. I'm a Juka man. I'm a Juke two more man. And C.J. Lewis turns a damn screen pass into 18 yards. They, they stack the box. They're doing it again, and we pass. It was simple as that. We're going to go a little play action here. Maybe get them on their toes. Let's see what happens. Worst comes to worst. He gets sacked because I get stuck on the old lineman. Makes sense. And we are the first game of the day. Uh, so we are not going to be able to see who wins that Buffalo-Miami matchup to see who one of these teams will be taking on the Super Bowl. But we're faced with a third and 19 already after that sack. That is, This is not great because now... We got our lie on good old Kirk Cousins. All right, let's go a little four verticals here. Let's see, hopefully we don't get a sack. That that's the ideal plan. Um, right here, Kirk. He gets sacked. Yep. Or he throws it away. Fourth and 19. Not a great way to start our first possession in the NFC Championship. And the Panthers score a touchdown. Missed the extra point though, so it is now six to nothing. I have one rush for one yard. That is going to change here. Great block. But I hate those tackles. And Brian O'Neill, it's it's a theme. Every game, this man gets hurt. We're faced with another third down. We need this conversion here. This Panthers defense has been no joke right here. Wide open, and we get the conversion. C.J. Lewis has all the yards currently for the Vikings, which is only 29. Not a great start, dude. Offensively, this start could not have been worse. I He held on, but that was not a great um, decision there, Kirk. Oh, they're pressing Jay Jettas. I gotta. I gotta. But first, I also have to set Hawkinson on. I don't even know. We'll put him on a fade, I guess. 
Now let's see. Get it to Justin Jefferson, the best receiver in the league, is going to tie it up and give us a lead following the extra point. Justin Jefferson finds himself in the end zone. First one of the playoffs. First touchdown for Justin Jefferson of this year's playoffs. What a route. What a play. You, you don't press Justin Jefferson. You don't play press coverage against him because he will beat you every time. And the Panthers get another score right back. Our defense just not did not come to play right now. Let's hope they do later on as CJ is probably going to get his largest gain of the game. And they've had the run pretty locked down, but it hasn't stopped me from getting these first downs on this possession. Let's see. Kick it out to me, Kirk. Oh, I see nothing but green grass. CJ with another big reception in the air. If that's the one good thing about Lewis, if he's not able to do it on the ground, he will hurt you in the air. What a play by the Vikings. This offense is starting to shake the rust off. And that is an awful pass, dude. That could have been picked. We're lucky it wasn't, Kirk. Bad, bad decision there. They're gonna all they're gonna do this game is just stack the box against me. That seems to be their method, and it has been working. Kirk, he's gonna pass it to me. I'm a Juka man. CJ Lewis is going to get us to the two. I didn't even call for it there. Kirk just called my number. And CJ delivers like he always does. But can we get in the end zone? CJ Lewis already 75 yards in the air. Already 100 yards on the game. And he just waltzes right into the end zone. Touchdown, Vikings. Barring an extra point, we will take the lead. And we finally get a stop. Um, but uh, we're not in a great spot. So, Kirk, just dump it out to me real quick. I'll make something of nothing there, and I immediately get a first down as we head to the two-minute warning. Let's go. Let's let's get a score here because they get the ball at halftime. Kirk's playing a great game, but he's making a lot of dumb passes, like, super quick. Doesn't make much sense to me. That does low. Nothing but green grass again. CJ runs out of bounds. I probably could have juked him for a little bit extra. But we have three timeouts. There's only a minute um, 38 left. So I kind of want to be kind of clock conservative here. So running out of bounds seems like the smartest play. That's also not Kirk, bro. You're not like he. That's the one thing about the. That's why I'm going to switch to quarterback. The quarterback CPU does not let plays or routes develop. He just slings it. it it's just super dumb. Look, look at that. Just let me run my route and immediate first down. We're going to go halfback screen, and we're going to scratch that because Von Bell just pressed up here. We're going we're to actually run the ball now because he would have blew that screen up. And look at this, CJ. How does Shaq Thompson get to me, dude? How? I don't understand it. All right, heck the ball, Kirk. Shaq Thompson gets blocked this time. Lewis is not going to get there. Third and two. We're going to run hurry up again. Gonna run, hurry up again. We're gonna run the ball. They they look like they're showing blitz again. They don't, and I'm not gonna get there, dude. Oh my God, Brian Burns blows it up, bro. They scored. They scored twice, bro. They scored a field goal before the half, and then they just scored a touchdown. Well, now we're in a sticky spot. Now we're in a real bad spot. C.J. Lewis gonna have to try and backpack us at this point. They've completely shut down the run game. So I've got to try and do it in the air. The run game is not working right here. Another another good game. Another first down for C.J. Lewis. He can do it as a back and he can do it as a receiver. Hopefully this will open up the pat. I mean the run game because it, they are just not. I got a great. Kirk, please throw the ball, dude. I got a great block on the blitz and it's just nothing. Like if you can't take advantage of that, I don't know what to do. Like, I really don't. Oh, boy. Play action. He's going to get sacked, isn't he? Yep. Oh, we're, go we're really going to lose to the seventh seed. Once again, third and 19. And we got... Wow, what an awful play call, dude. <laughs> what an awful play call. Oh, TJ Hawkinson incomplete. We're going to have the punt. Wow, this is going... This could not be going worse. And the Vikings score again. With six minutes left, that might do it. We, like, we need to score here. We need a touchdown. They have 112 rushing yards to our 47. 
They've completely shut down our running game. Completely shut it down. And since we have to rely on the pass, I wow, I've this is bad, dude. The seventh seed is really gonna take out the top seeds. And also, when Kirk does stuff like that, just dumping it out so quick, it doesn't help. It, but we need to let those deep routes develop. Like right here, please throw it to um, Justin Jefferson. I almost forgot his name for a second. We're not gonna, we're not gonna have him open. The safety, the safety stood. Third and seven, this is it. This is do or die here. We need to score. I mean, we need this first down. No! Kirk! Brother, you can't be serious! Why would you throw it to him? I I was wide open up the field. I was wide. Oh, I could not have been more open. Could not have been more open. And once again, CJ Lewis saves the day. Why? This is why I'm going to quarterback. This is why. This is why. Because Madden's just AI is so stupid, dude. It makes playing any other position but why well, I didn't. I just want to hike the ball. I just want to hike the ball. Yep, there we go again. Same exact route. It did nothing before. We got three minutes left, and Kirk is just throwing little um, little small routes. Like, th these are not the routes we need right now. We, we need big plays. All right, we really need big plays. There's 340 left, Kirk. Get rid of the ball! Kirk, dude, you have to just air it out. Just throw it. We cannot be taking all of the... That's what's killed us. Two sacks for like 10 yards have just killed possessions. That, that's how we go out. This is how we go out. The, because Kirk can't get rid of the ball. This is how we go out. No run game and Kirk Cousins being an incompetent quarterback. This is it. This is this is the way this series is going to end. It's not going to end in a Super Bowl. And, and yep, there it is. Game ending pick. There it is. Yep. Wow. Wow, my disappointment is unmatched. And that's going to do it. We get absolutely dominated by the 7 seed Panthers and they move on to the Super Bowl. They've ta they took out the top 3 seeds. They took out all three top seeds in the NFC to make it to the Super Bowl. I had 47. I only had 12 attempts. That's how good their defense was at stopping the run. That I couldn't even run it. Bryce Young just diced up our entire defense. Miles Sanders completely cooked. Unbelievable sad way to end the season. What an awful way to go out. I'm not. I'm definitely not playing another season um, as a running back. I don't think I can stomach another season as the running back. So, we're going to advance the week. Sad way we lose to the 9-8. and eight. We lost, but we had the biggest, like, they just dominated us. A champion on and off the field. Man of the year. Bro, it's not even a cutscene. Go to hell. He's like, come on, really, Madden? We're not going to have a cutscene? It's you, the playoff bracket. And it is the Bills. Oh, my God, bro. This Panthers team wins. This is the greatest playoff run in NFL history. There, there will be. I do not want to play the Pro Bowl. Good. I do not feel like playing the Pro Bowl. I'm, I'm glad they didn't force me to. Super Bowl week view. Yearly awards. Obviously, I won MVP, but I'm assuming if I simulate, it would actually show it. Sad we couldn't end it off with the Super Bowl. Bills, Panthers, who will become victorious in Las Vegas, bro, I swear to God, if it's the Panthers. Uh, is it going to show it? 2023 season recap. Oh, my God. Yeah, they got obliterated. 48-7. to seven. They got absolutely torn apart. Uh, MVP, C.J. Lewis. Coach of the year, Arthur Smith. That ain't ever happening. Offensive player of the year, also C.J. Lewis. Defensive player of the year, Micah Parsons. Offensive rookie of the year, C.J. Lewis. I took home every offensive award. And uh, defensive rookie of the year, Lucas Van Ness. Von Miller wins another Super Bowl MVP. And the Bills are one-time champions. That's going to do it for the C.J. Lewis running back career. He will be back as a quarterback. I won't be doing it in this actual mode because playing a quarterback kind of sucks in this mode because of the interceptions um, and just the fact that uh, the camera sucks and you have to play like every game. So I'm probably not going to be doing a quarterback in this mode because I've already gone through this mode. I already know everything about it. So, I might be doing it in franchise where I can have control over all the settings and everything. But, 
that's going to be it for me. Sadly, we cannot get C.J. Lewis a championship, but hopefully in his next chapter, we will get it. GG.